so good We're loving and hating and making scenes Now we just see everything we believe We just see everything Hey what's up there everybody, it's your boy Coach from Gaming, and today in this video I'm going to be talking about YouTube's new algorithm theory, um, well, algorithm, it's not really a theory, but I guess you could technically say it is a theory, and uh, before I jump into this video, I need you to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and turn on the post notifications down at the bottom, and uh, in this way you'll be entered into a giveaway, and you have to comment what kind of cards you want and all that, or you can go to the discussion page and tell me what you want, and you do have to be active for at least a week on all on all the videos I upload, or you can be inactive on previous videos as well. Anyways, let's get into this video. Now the most important thing about the new algorithm is watch time factors. Like if you have, let's say like, like if you have like shorter videos, like lately I've noticed that if you hit the 10 minute mark you can get this an extra add in, which a lot of people like to do for the extra revenue because the views have been cut in half, because I'm not sure no one's not really. No one's one hundred percent sure why every, all the views have been cut, but mostly is because they changed up how you see videos, like in your recommended page. Recommended page, like instead of recent videos and you getting notifications, you get old videos from months ago to years ago, compared to a video I just uploaded this morning. Like you don't get all that. Some, sometimes you do, sometimes you don't. And like I'll try and get notifications for a channel. Like Olin Rogers, for example, I tried turning them on for his. It doesn't work for his. I'm not sure why it doesn't work, but I, it just doesn't. And it's bullshit. I and mean, like, it, it's weird, and I really hope that they fix it because the weird new algorithm AI thing is trying to delete like content that goes against the guidelines. Like, for example, that's why Durr's channel got deleted. He got too many copyright strikes, and then like everyone was getting copyright strikes for a while. Even I was for no freaking reason. Like, I mean, people have been doing tests where they literally don't say anything for ten solid minutes, and they still get a copyright strike for violating the terms. And the title is like, "This is me being this is a test." Like, really? Come on. It's stupid. And like, it. It's, why? Like, you know, just why? Like why would you, why would you want to do that to YouTube? Like why YouTube? Why would you do this? No, it, it's fucking stupid, and they they really need to fix this. I really hope that they do. It, another another thing to help grow your channel would be to self promote. Self promote helps a lot, and half the it's like half views from being browsed, half are like like my main three sources of views are suggested, search, and external. I share the shit out of my stuff on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, just whatever I can, Google Plus, and I just spam it on socials, and I ask people to like check it out, even if it's not, like, for a few minutes, and, and it helps, not too much, because I don't get that many views, and I was dead for a while too, and I lost a lot of active subscribers, and I might bring back the Dying Light series, because that was doing pretty damn well, There's Glitches and duplication stuff was doing great, and I might even bring start bringing some of that shit back because that stuff was doing quite nice. Now, uploading frequently does help, and like the problem with the it, it, if you upload like daily, people will know that there's gonna be a new video every day, and sometimes you can either do like once a week, but at least do once a week. It's longer than that. The chance of your channel growing quickly is going to take a while, and just the, the less work you put in, the less stuff you put into it, the less it's going to grow. And so far, my effort, it doesn't really show up for a good month or two, and I know that. I know to expect it's not going to show up for a little bit. I can't. You can't expect results overnight. This shit takes time. Like my Skyrim video, I uploaded like seven, eight months ago, and is just recently getting a ton of views. Compared to well, what I normally get, I don't get that many views on average, anyways, and I, I wish I did get more, but I mean, stuff happens, you know. You you, you can't you can't win all the time. It happens. Now another big thing is being passionate about your content. If you're being passionate, like I was watching this one guy today. I can't remember his channel name. It's like Moraz or something like that. His 
he used to do gaming and then he switched up to how-to videos and that started blowing up his channel and you never know like even if you want to make one thing if you are better at making another thing go with the other thing that works for your channel or do both like I know that vlogs do much better for my channel and so I'm gonna start like I'm starting to incorporate that into my videos like I'm working on getting the camera so I can start recording footage up in the corner but it, it all, everything just takes time, you know? It, and my video quality is always getting better too, so that, that's always nice too. And some, if you're going to have shorter videos, keep it, keep it at least like five, five, six minutes. If you're going to have slightly longer videos, do like 10 to, 10 to 20. If you're going to do the really long videos, I would just say 30 to, 30 to an hour. But everyone has their own thing. It just depends what kind of, like, uh, audience you're going for. I, me personally, I'm going for all around. Like, I want people to come in for shorter videos and longer videos. And it's somewhat working. I noticed that the shorter ones do tend to do better than the longer ones. But at the longer ones do get that extra ad. So it's, it, you just gotta pick and choose how you want, how, how you want it all to go down. I mean, it all happens. I know Derv recently got his channel deleted for breaking copyright terms. I, was like, I mean, he, he could have avoided it. All he had to do was not use other people's content. It, it's pretty hard. He wasn't getting in trouble for the fake give giveaways, which I wouldn't be surprised if he... He should have gotten in trouble for that. Same thing with Codename Black. He got in trouble for that stuff, too, I think. But I don't know. He's almost at a million subscribers in, what, a, a little bit over a year, which is absolutely ridiculous. Like, that, it's so frustrating to me. So why, like, how? Why? You know, like, just, just why? That, that's not fair at all. And, well, more, more things you could go for is if you're active with your community, it can help a ton on growing your channel. Just find your niche. Finding a niche helps even more. There, there's, there's like a ton of things I could sit there and tell you. I can tell you to make content all the time. But more than anything, it comes down to you and the person. It comes down to you as the creator on your channel to do it. You can't sit there and be like, oh, yes, I'm going to do this and just not do it. You, you have to do it. If you want your stuff to work and grow, you have to make sure you put effort and time into it. And that eventually helps you create a better channel and better con content, and it helps you grow a lot. And it's it's kind of interesting how it all works. Like, well, let's see. I, I put a ton of effort and time into those duplication videos. And they are some of the most viewed videos on my channel. And I even put... Now, one of the cool things I like to do is like to make these little random music mixes. Because, well, if you're going to have a niche, it's nice to have a, some videos and other areas as well so people can pull in more people having like a variety is helpful because it pulls in a lot of different people but and also have but contents of having uh, a wide variety is you can't get a ton of views on that and stuff it's you can and you can't and you don't want to like make too much clickbait because it'll, you'll get like a bunch of subscribers but not very good views but I don't know, I mean, it, it all just depends how you do it, you know? And we're almost at the 10 minute mark on this anyways. And, well, what I'd like to appreciate you guys is just to sit here and enjoy this content of Rising Zero Dawn while I have some nice music in the background. Just so we can hit that extra, you know, couple minutes. For like the next minute or so. Peace out, guys. Have a nice day. Enjoy the content. Thank <laughs> you.